and welcome to the show called The Seller. I got a lot of shit and a lot of shit to fucking say. I got to start with good trades and bad trades in the offseason. I'm the Detroit Lions. I'm trying to make shit happen. I'm trying to get my team popping and I'm trying to get good. I like being part of the dynasty, so thank you. A pla pla pla, a clap. So. That's right, we back. But some of these trades, man, are out of disrespect. You know, I'm very upset with some of you dudes on uh, some of these trades you sit. Andre, you was a good dude. You was a cool brother. But pick six for weeks. What the fuck were you thinking? What did you think about? What was on your mind? I think it was the bomb guys you got on your team, so you try to trade HB. And, ugh. Ugh, very, very bad. Ugh, don't like it, don't like it. Man, I got a sound. I got, I got a, I got a sound I want to share with you, man. This is how I feel. Bad trade. Bad trade. That's how we feel. Boo. We very upset. We very upset. Why would I send you weeks for pick six? There's no linebacker like this guy. There's no body that good. There's no body that smooth. And you send me a trade like that out of disrespect. I don't respect you for that, but you was a cool dude. So stay up. Let's talk about somebody else who offered me a trade. We speak every day. He's a good friend. He helps me get back in the dynasty. So no disrespect. Matty Ice. You was a cool dude. The first few trades you sent, I was like, it's cool. It's good. Cool. Good looking. Good looking. Good looking. But this last trade today you sent me was a little disrespect. I was disrespected. You wanted me to send you Ivis, my defensive and slash defensive tackle to you in exchange for me sending you a second and third for your pick 10 or 17. And I'm sending you a second third in Ivis. I don't care if you use the calculator, but that's disrespect. Disrespect. You don't do that to HB. And when you disrespect me, I'm gonna disrespect you. You was a cool dude, but you made a fool out of yourself because I'm not going to send that trade or submit it. That shit is not going through. Where's the damn calculator? It's time to use it. Ugh, a lot of ducks being thrown, man. Shit. Gotta change my shoes and hope I can find my chucks because I'm I'm weirded out. I'm weird. I'm like shocked. Like, whew, these trades are horrible. I talked to freaking Dion, Nasty Noob. He said the calculator needs to be used. I understand why, because some of you dudes is cruel. You guys raise oil prices for nothing. You're really high on your team. You want this, you want that. Some of these guys are not good as you guys say. So other guys in the dynasty, I got to say, shit's not true. Watch your DMs. Watch your trades, man. Watch the players. Look at the trade. Some of these guys are disrespectful. Disrespectful. KP, you was a good dude. A real good homie. But maybe I think you got a little upset after I beat you. You said you wanted Stan the Man. You not going to get Stan the Man unless you send in three first round picks. The trade you sent was a little disrespectful, especially since you're picking real late. Like, a first round pick doesn't cover for Stan. I... I, 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 pickles. I don't know what you were thinking, but that was bad. That was bad. That was bad. Man, my hat's not even on my head because that was a bad trade, man. Woo. Woo, man. That was crap. I hope you're on my schedule because I got plans to beat the shit out of you. That was uh, disrespectful. The only leg legit trade, I mean, that I really got, man, was Nasty New. He offered me Dalvin Cook in a good first round. In exchange um, for weeks, you know, exchange for weeks in a second. That was that was a smooth trade. I can do that. He, a lot helps me, and a lot helps him. But some of you other dudes, whew, you guys are disrespectful, disrespectful. Oh man, I got to get on YouTube, man. I got to get on YouTube, Chris. That trade you sent, you should have known that shit was not happening, man. You offered me. Another player that probably can someday fit my scheme, but I don't think it can happen. 
You offered me a horrible trade, bro. A horrible trade. You want a quarterback. I know you do. I know you always been a wide receiver kind of guy, but the trade you sent me was disrespectful. Disrespectful, and I'm not happy. So this is what I think of your trade. And maybe to others. Maybe they're going to think the same way. Horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Ah, disaster. Man, expert post it clowny. Clowney's good. You know, I saw him on Twitter. He said Clowney's leaving the next. I mean, he won the Super Bowl. So, I, I mean, I respect him. I really don't even have nothing to say about expert. I wouldn't even diss him right now because Clowney's a good dude. I don't know what kind of trade he would offer for Clowney, but he's probably a, you know, maybe he can still get a, a second, third, maybe fourth, but not a first. Strength is really low. He never really has strength, but... A 99 block shed. He's really good, really competitive with that. So I gotta say that's that's decent. But trades, man, trades, mm -hmm. trades, man. Come on, we gotta get it right. We gotta get it right, baby. We gotta get it right. Oh man, we gotta get it right. There was another trade, man, that really shocked the shit out of me, man. That really shocked the fucking shit out of me. I'm not gonna mention no names. I'm gonna say, Mr. Raskin user, you offer me. Samaje, Puri, for weeks, for weeks. You offer me Samaje for Puri for weeks. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm killed. I, I can't believe you did that. I can't believe you offered some shit like that. You must have got off the toilet after the shit fell out and went in the toilet and you couldn't flush it and then try to pack that shit up in a cup and send that shit off to me. That's shit. I don't want that kind of shit. What kind of stuff is that, man? What were you thinking? You're disrespectful. You know I dropped the seller. You know I'm a clown. I'm right now. I'm here because I'm go clown. Ridiculous ass fucking trade, man. You done started some beef now, man. You done started some beef with HP, man, on this show. Now I got to now I gotta dish you, man. That Samaje Perrine is shit. That was the worst trade I have ever seen in the history of the dynasty. He's a bum. He's a bum. And, and you really want to ruin your cap? A 12.6 million penalty and send that dude over to me? He only got an 87 speed. Like, are you serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? What were you thinking? Ugh. I mean, your team is not good at all. Your quarterback name is Turnbill. Kevin turned bull. You know what? You know what? He actually got a good throwing power. Throwing power. And a good throw on a run. I mean, your quarterback's good. Your halfbacks are shit. You got nobody. You are looking to draft a running back in the draft. Because you need one. I mean, this running back is slow as fuck. My grandma will beat him. My grandma will be in the wheelchair and outwill him. Man. Man, people, what's up with these trades? Yeah, but that's all I'm gonna say. This is a short video of the seller. I'm dropping beats on you. I'm dropping bombs on you. I'm letting some of you dudes have it. I'm letting you have it. You're not playing me. I am not gonna have a messed up season off a silly trade. Yeah, I want a first round pick. Yeah, I want to draft in the first round. Yes, yes, I do. Yes, I like Holly Berry be my wife. Yeah. Sure, some of that shit just don't come into play. But I got to say, you do stay up, and we out this bad boy HBO going out this bitch. Hey.